São Paulo, Caio Brás conversa com a cantora inglesa Charlie XCX, que com apenas 21 anos é conhecida no mundo todo pelo hit I Love It. How did the music evolve in you? How did your musical verb start? Um, I mean, I started making music properly when I was 14. Um, and I guess it's just since then, you know, I was putting songs on MySpace and doing that kind of thing. When I wrote my first record, um, that was kind of me growing up and me like realizing myself as a person and as an artist. With Marina in the Diamonds, have you collaborated with her? Yeah, on that song, Just Desserts, yeah. Were you on the runway show that Tom Ford used your, your track as a soundtrack? What, he did? You don't know that? No, I didn't know that. Yes, he did! That's so great, I didn't know that. Awesome, thanks Tom Ford, you're a babe. Now that the shoes are on the floor, you suddenly decided to knock on wood. The Icon of Pop collaboration that you did, I love it, it's so big here. It plays in every nightclub, everywhere we go. How did that happen? I was in Stockholm for the first time working on my album and um, I was working with Patrick Berger who I'd never worked with before that day and so I got him to send me some tracks. One of them was uh, like a rough demo of I Love It and I just wrote it in my hotel room in like a half an hour and showed it to him and I didn't like it, like I didn't think it was very cool and he was like this is so cool, I was like okay I don't really want it though so then Icona Pop needed a song and they heard the song and they liked it so they like sung over the vocal that I'd done and that kind of became the song and they like tweaked it and made it their own and like took it in this new direction. You've had this great V Magazine cover with Sky Ferreira and Grimes. Yeah, it was just really cool. It was such a great shoot and it was like styled by Karine Rothfeld as well, which was, you know, amazing because she's such a fashion legend. So, and we had these like mice and they were like weeing on us and everything. It was, it was, was it scary? It was kind of gross, but I mean, <laughs> it was cool. And, you know, we were dressed in like amazing Givenchy pieces and yeah it was a great day it was really cool and the interview of the magazine was done by by ginger spice jerry hallowell our like childhood icon <laughs> yeah yeah how was that we got to pick who we wanted to interview us so i was like Jerry Hallowell, that would be really cool. She was so cool, you know, she like knew everything about me. She'd done her research. Personal style, I love your heels and it's kind of a platform. Is that the, kind of a 90s vibe that you have? I wore like buffaloes a lot for a while, like real like big platforms, but um, I'm kind of over them now and I'm... Bought... Kind of a Spice Girls vibe? Yeah, totally, and they were really cool, but I've moved on now and I, because I bought these like Alaya shoes They're like the coolest shoes ever. Do you love tartan skirts? Yeah, I, I feel like I went through a big tartan phase. Um, I wore like a lot of tartan mini skirts. I love suits and I love tailoring and I'll always love platforms and mini skirts. I also bought some like Vivian Westwood uh, platforms recently. Uh, which I'm like living in as well.